There are large NPM packages and there are small NPM packages. Generally, we want to use and develop smaller sized packages because of the environmental constraints. To use smaller packages, we can approach it from two ways. First, before installation and second, after installation or development. Before installation, we can use a website called Bundlephobia, which we will supply a package name and it will return us various informations including bundle size, download times and package composition. It is really neat and useful tool. But now, let's look at our second case, which is development. Assuming that we have already installed few packages and wanted to get their size rankings, we can easily fetch that by using the cost of modules package. We just install it globally and call it inside our directory. In this example, as you can see, I've already installed few packages. To get their sizes, I just type cost of modules and I pass include dev argument to include development packages as well. And when I've executed that, as you can see, it will bring us the list of modules with their corresponding sizes. So by looking at that, we can find and replace the large modules with the smaller alternatives. And that said, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If that is the case, make sure to hit the like and subscribe. See you next time. Take care.